Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad to see you guys again. <laughs> so today I'm going to be giving a tutorial on uh, a nude and everyday look. Something very simple and easy to do that you can wear really quickly when you just want to step out. And I'll be telling you guys about my stay at the NYC orientation camp. So before I begin to tell my tales, I want to set my face. I'm going to be using this face primer. This is the Makeup Academy Pro Base. Doing my brows the same way I explained in my brow tutorial video, using this Mac pencil and the Maybelline tattoo brow. So I'll be right back. I'll just. Shop with me okay, my foundation and I'm going to try this classic makeup foundation. This is in shade CF05. I'm going to blend with my puff, but I always prefer my puff being damp. So you can either use water or you use setting spray. So I'm going to be using this classic setting spray. So just wait it in between. Now we actually blend your foundation properly. So I was opportune to um, get posted to Lagos, so I went to the um, orientation camp at Agege. That is right, the NYC orientation camp for Lagos is located in Yanukaja. And I went into camp late. I went the second day after the opening of the scene because you know we don't. I didn't really like to be the one to open the gate for anything. So. And then I was posted to Lagos with two of my very close friends from school. I'm really, really excited from the beginning. There. So we got there. The first thing that really just registration. Registration is really stressful. You have to get your khaki. That's your uniform, you have to get a room, account. you had to find your platoon. It was just a lot of stress. Yeah. So next I'm going to conceal using this pro concealer. Using this pro concealer and the shade is fun. So after the registration and you know, all the next day was the um opening ceremony, I think the opening parade. I don't know what it's called, opening something. And it was really frustrating in the air because we had to stand for like three hours or four hours. I can't even remember how long it lasted, but it lasted for a very long time. And then this babe on the line tried to pick a fight with me. What happened was that she she was, I don't know, maybe playing with her friend. And then she stepped on me. And then NYC boots is very, very uncomfortable. I don't know what they put inside that shoe. I think it's wood. It's so uncomfortable. So I was already feeling pains on my feet here, yeah? and then she stepped on me. I agree that I actually pushed her, but it was not because I wanted to be mean. It was reflex because the pain was really sharp. And then she was, and then I was even expecting her to say sorry, but then she didn't say sorry. But then I think I didn't care really. And then she, oh, she, I can't even really remember. And then she was like, why did I push her like that? And you stepped on me. Normally you should say sorry, but then you don't want to say sorry, and I'm like, okay, I really don't care. And then are you asking me why I pushed you? Like, you are a bitch. You are this. You are that. What do you even have? All these Unilag you know, like babes that will just be forming levels. All these Unilag. You know, I think she actually just had a beef for Unilag you know, like girl. So getting food from the kitchen was not an option for me. So we, we as me and my friends usually used to eat at Mami Market. And Mami Market food is actually very nice. It's cheap, it's very affordable. It's like the same price that you get food outside. So the only thing that was quite expensive were the drinks and it was like 20 naira or 15 naira. So the next thing to do now is to contour my face. And I'll be using this contour stick. This is Revolution London. Right? Yes, this is Makeup Revolution London and it is in shade F14. The 
inside of my nose i don't have a small puff i can't find it so i'm going to improvise and use a small puff so now the next thing is to use setting powder but first i want to talk about mommy market i have seen mommy market a lot so mommy market is like a supermarket <laughs> but in some kind of open field yes that's how best i can describe it it's like somewhere you can get everything i don't think there's anything you would need in camp that you would necessarily need in camp that you can't find mommy market is always so much fun at night that is where you see those girls that wear skimpy white shorts and be on things for boys that are using um airpods that Lagos camp, if you don't have money, you'll just be feeling intimidated. You've seen people, some people have all the Apple gadgets you can think of. They have the new um, iPhone, they have the AirPods, they have iWatch, iPad, i everything that you can have. One person like this who possess everything. Well, that Lagos camp. You can't have money. You'll just be feeling intimidated. So now I'm going to use this cover fix setting powder. So now the next thing is to just do a very, very simple eyeshadow, something very 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 simple. So I'm going to be using this palette. So my best part of camp was the band. Yes, I joined the band in camp because, sorry, I'm using this light shade of brown. This is something very very simple that we're doing. So I joined the band. I'm going to explain to you guys why I joined the band. So it was on a um, swearing in ceremony. I don't even know what exactly it's called. I'm not sure it's called swearing in ceremony. Sha on that day that I had a fight with that girl. So they just came in, the band guys, were, and then they were drumming. And it was just really nice. I don't know, it was just really catchy. Because those guys are really good. I feel, I, I feel like I feel like they have a superpower. They were really, really good. So they made an announcement that if you are interested in joining the band, just come and see us after you're swearing it. And then you know, I was like, it's not just do, 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 just to drum drum. Let me just go there. So I went and we did the tryouts and all. And then they had picked some of us. And then we had to be going for rehearsals like regularly. It was then I mean it was not easy. Apart from beating the drum, you have to count the beats. You have to know the songs. The band was just so so much fun. You know, it was really difficult. There were times that I used to feel really bad because I didn't learn the sequence on time or I didn't know the number of beats. But I just really loved it. It was just so much fun. And then I really loved those times that I got to play. I'm going to upload some videos. I have videos of when I was playing the drum, so I'm going to upload some videos so you guys can see. <laughs> Like an avenue for you to cut out all those unnecessary activities like manual drills, um, unnecessary lectures, uh, match pass, all those things are just not needed. So now I'm going to contour my eyeshadow using, and then for your contouring, you can use dark colors, you can use black, you can use a dark shade of blue, you can use a dark shade of red. Basically, you can use a dark shade of anything. So today I'm going to Hmm, let me see. I'm going to use a dark shade of brown. I'm going to just use brown throughout. So now I'm going to use a fluffy brush to blend. So now the next thing is to line my eyeliner. 
it's ADS Mesmerizing Eyeliner. So, next thing now is to use the mascara. So now I have to line my eyes and I'm using this MAC pencil. So, another part of NYC that is very interesting is the Alawi part like the money that you get so at camp we got two different phones i think the first one was bicycle allowance and the second one was maybe transportation allowance or something which i got i think the total of the money was about three thousand something they just called us out one day and be like okay you guys have to go home because of the old coronavirus stuff i was actually happy to go home yeah but then at the same time i was I think it was that point and when they asked us to go home that people had already started to make friends people had already started to enjoy camp and all so it was sad but then at the same time i was glad to just go the federal government has been allowing for two months even though we've not been working so i'm actually glad i went to camp this coronavirus so now the next thing is this powder this is the la pride powder and this is what it looks like inside so I usually use the ebony shade, just very little really, I don't think I need too much. So the next thing now is to apply bronzer, what's in between your highlighting and contour. Although it is blended, it should be blended, but you would see that there is a tiny place where the transitioning is most well seen. So that particular place is where you put your bronzer. Forget my nose. So I'm trying to do a new lipstick so I'm going to be using this lipstick this is classic so now I'm going to blend using this brush so now I'm going to apply gloss I'm not really a fan of my lipstick this gloss was actually a gift for my sister it's one direction I don't know it came with a palette a bigger palette so Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Please don't forget to subscribe, to like, leave a comment, and also follow me on Instagram at Aditi Bye!